Hey guys, Crew of Blind Wave. I'm Eric. I'm Shane. Uh, Shane, we're going to be going on with our Honest Trailer Reaction okay. Series. Uh, we're going to be watching Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles 2, Secret of the Ooze. I don't have to even begin to ask how much you have to love this movie. I love Ninja Turtles. Yeah. Uh, I love all of them. I love everything. I mean, I, I'm just saying, we've been best friends for 15 years, and I don't know if you've ever gotten on a computer and not checked Ninja Turtles' website. <laughs> Like as like a prerequisite of everything else you have to do once you get on a computer. Ninja you're Turtles, Star in Wars. Mind. Well, I mean, uh, honestly, growing up, my favorites were probably the one and three. Yeah, I love two. Honestly, I thought two was always my favorite. I mean, one definitely is always the classic, uh, but two I probably watched the most just because I was so in love with the idea of the new mutant animals. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I mean, I just watched them all over and over and over again, man. Yeah. I mean, like, the honestly... Vanilla Ice at the end? I mean, it's just so great. Super Shredder, played by Kevin Nash. Yeah. One thing I loved about the first one the most was just the... Like, the, you know, even as a little kid, I loved fight scenes. And the, oh, yeah. And, like, you know, being on the rooftop, awesome fight yeah. scene between them and Shredder. Yeah, and I always, like, it's just even the like, gritty realism worked so well with the you know, kitty stuff, too, I, I felt like. Yeah. You know? Well, 2 was a lot more, I think, catered towards the people who watched the cartoon. I do feel like... the two, cartoon yeah. got more popular. I, exactly. I feel like 2 was definitely the, hey, we can sell a lot of toys with this. Yeah, it was kind of goofy. Yeah. But, but I, don't, I don't know, it was, a good, it was good to hear about, hear more about the Turtles' origin yeah. story. Um, you know, Kino. I, I like Kino, but I don't, I don't think he could replace Casey Jones. I, I yeah. I kind of wonder why... They chose for Casey not to be in it. And then he came back in the third one. Yeah, he did. Just to take care of some hockey players. Or some oh, yeah, but he's also his samurai. ancestor. He played his ancestor. He did, didn't he? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> wow. I need to rewatch that movie because I never knew that. Yeah. The third one, I... The third one took some big risks, and I really liked it for that. I love the third one. Yeah. I, the one thing I don't like about the third one is the spots. They, they look a little cheaper. Yeah. For sure. I mean, that's the one thing. You Why watch they just that... use the same damn costume. I'm just saying, you watch that first movie, they still hold up, I think. I think I think they look incredible. It's incredible. Yeah. And then they look good. I mean, you could probably have some better facial movements and, and, and probably lip Jim sync. H- yeah, that's what I'm saying. I wonder, because the way Jim Henson did those, I wonder if there's anyone alive now besides them, because he's passed away, but his creature yeah. shop is still there. Yeah, but I mean, like, you know, guys like, you know, uh, Del Toro and stuff that have just pushed the, uh, the, uh, Animatronics Auto and stuff Veronica? like that. Auto Veronica? Jurassic Park. <laughs> yeah. Let's go what ahead. What you think of the fourth one? The fourth one was fun. Uh, it I, I like it the was way one. more, um, I, I felt like at least, it was way more uh, supernatural. A little bit. You know, bit. with well, the whole the, God the stuff and yeah. interdimensional beings. But I mean, that's not without, you know, I like without the, the realm of... I like the characters. Yeah. I mean, whenever you have a world like, you know, Dimension X and, mm-hmm. and Krang and stuff like that, I mean... I, that yeah. makes it was more. It felt more like the. It cartoon. combined the cartoon and the movies together. We yeah. know it's a sequel to the fourth because at the yeah. end we see the scepter. Exactly. Yeah. But one, one thing I really like is the family dynamic between the between the brothers. Yeah. And they call him Splinter Father. And, and the the sh- fight between Raph and Leo. Leo. That was a long yeah. time coming. That was. That awesome. made the movie for me. Yeah. And Raph won. But anyways, this is Nin- this is Ninja Turtles two. Yep. So let's so, check it out. Okay. This came out right before the new movie came out. Based on the dark brooding comic that became a children's cartoon that became the worst musical Hey, I like that. Time, That's good shit. That proves the turtle franchise was ridiculous. Way no. Why is it? Okay, this was Hey, I watched. Did you ever watch that? No. I used to get up and skip stones because of this shit, man. I never seen this. Dude, it was good. The secret of I watched the shit out of that. That's sure that suit was better looking than the first one. Yeah. I guess it looks better than ugly CGI. Ugh. Your favorite turtles have returned to kick some shell. But this time, due to stupid parent complaints about the first movie, watch as their iconic weapon stay. Now I never I I've always felt this, yes. I feel like this is a, this is a legit criticism. Yeah. And words. Come on, just 
stab somebody already. Get ready to hang ten with these four overly large trained ninjas who are terrible at hiding. He's <laughs> 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 a fucking ninja. Remember how well they hit in the first movie? Yeah. Oh, did they get stuck in a net? Dude, that would suck. <laughs> I've always thought that, thought that. In a world full of cartoon characters and action figures you loved, spend more time with these human characters you don't like. Kino, an obnoxious little twerk. Dream on. But what I do, I'll dream of something a little thinner. This boring science guy and this completely random lady who calls herself April O'Neil. Did the people who made this even like the cartoon? Where's Krang? Slash Baxter? So bogus. The Shredder has returned, and returned, and returned, and he probably smells like shit now. Watch him strike fear into the hearts of men with his ability yeah, to Yeah, but that one seemed... Oh, I shot it. That was awesome. That was awesome. And his oh, lieutenant yeah. Tatsu, Tatsu also stands and does nothing while his enemies are right in front of him. Together, they'll recruit a city inexplicably filled with martial arts trained teenage runaways who will vastly outnumber our heroes, yet can't ever seem to take out four slow dudes in huge rubber turtle suits. Why are they dancing? <laughs> as they battle for control of the secret of the ooze, which is never really explained now that I mention it, but for some reason can turn turtles into ninja turtles. Turn flowers into bigger flowers and turn Bebop and Rocksteady into two lame ass ripoffs that no one ever asked for. <laughs> so gear up for That's a kid's silly. action flick. So terrified to show any fun ninja action. Its climax consists of taking out the shredder with a guitar solo. Yeah. Now that they're mentioning this, I... Yeah, well, I was say, that's a problem I have with the second one and the third. There's no badass fights. Even when I was, like, eight years old, I loved a good fight. I love the Vanilla Ice Cream. Oh, that was cool, yeah. I mean, I know it's ridiculous, but... Stop dancing with Vanilla Ice. Stop it! What are you doing? No, Ninja, no, Ninja, no! Starring the Blue Ranger, Wreck-It Rap, Bart Simpson... Nerdatello, Redness Neverclean, Surf Ninja, Asian Darth Vader, Angel's <laughs> Mom, and Justin Bieber's Dad, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles 2, The Secret of the Ooze. Ooze. So parents were mad about them using their weapons, but totally okay with them advocating an all-pizza diet? Psh, hypocrites. Good point. Be sure yeah. to subscribe. Wow. That was funny. I mean, there were some parts in there that, like, you can tell they're just kind of making the joke. But Reaching. there's some there's some very valid criticisms in there, too. Oh, yeah. And stuff that I never really thought about. I've never once thought about Leo having his sword with a cut in the net. I did when I was a little kid. I mean, Ar swords. I mean, hell, R2 did it. Like, no, like nothing. When yeah. He was caught in his net. Mm-hmm, he did. I mean, Luke had his... Didn't Luke have his lightsaber in there? He couldn't reach it? I couldn't use the force to bring it out. I don't know. Anyway, um, I thought it was a funny video. Whenever you get, the, the older you get, and then you watch things like this that talk about stuff that you just loved when you were a kid, you it's it's so hard to get past that nostalgia filter of like, yeah, but I love it. I don't care. You know? I think that's what matters the most. I think so, too. I, I feel like, yeah, I, think, I feel like I'd rather have that than watch a new movie that I love. I'd rather be able to think about fondly a movie I used to love. Yeah, well, I still love it. Yeah. I used to love it. I still love it. Yeah. I've seen it a million times. I just don't want to watch it again, honestly. But I, I gotta say, like, uh, you know, they have some very valid criticisms with Shredder and Tatsu, and Shredder's I, well, keep coming back. But that scene where he's like, you know, who challenged, you know? And then Shredder comes, like, I challenge. Master, Master Shredder. Shredder. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I love She's it. She's the key to finding the creatures that did this to me. <laughs> it's so, it's just so nostalgic. There's just nothing. Well, they nothing... lowered the age of the target audience in the second. Absolutely, movie. it was definitely made to sell toys, and that's fine. And that's fun. I bought the fucking toys. I did. And you know what? I, had a I good bought damn more time. when the new ones came out. Yeah, and the new cartoon came yeah. out. So, so we'll have to do the uh, the honest trailer reaction to the new cartoon. Uh, no, the new CGI one, because I knew that one was coming out. You mean right. like, well, partly CGI. It was, you mean TMNT? Right? Yeah, of course. Everybody knows what I meant. Not TMNT, but Ninja Turtles. Ninja Turtles. Not TNT. I don't think they've done anything for TNT. 
Which is a shame because that's a fun movie too. Mm-hmm. I love Leo and his like jungle outfit. Oh yeah, I forgot about that. He was in South America trained to become a better leader. Yeah, like the Hulk. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys, that's everything for like this. Like Arrow, we went back to the island. Just like just like uh, Arrow and the island of Ilan Niau or whatever it is. Anyway, that's our honest trailer reaction for Ninja Turtles 2 Secret of the Use. If you like this reaction, if you'd like to do another reaction, just put it down in the comments below. Mm -hmm. Make sure you like and subscribe uh, to our channel. Mm -hmm. And I'm Eric. I'm Shane. We'll see you guys next time!